Hello everyone, this is Vishale from Vision Language Experts. I have Ayanta over here, who recently smashed his IELTS exam with 777.8. Actually, he got 8.5 in listening, and he got 7.5 in speaking. First of all, congratulations to you. Thank you for saying that. Ayanta, I know that um, you were doing PD before you, you know, transited to IELTS. The major difficulty which a lot of students face is the writing part. Then it comes to speaking. But you, you know, performed very well in writing. You got seven in the fourth attempt, and then seven point five in speaking. What was your secret, and how did you manage to, you know, make this transition from PT to IELTS, especially for the writing, very smoothly? Okay, so I think with the PT, I had my own style of writing, like everyone does, and then uh, the, there are certain factors that IELTS take into consideration while marking your writing. Uh, uh, so I wasn't really aware of that, but my trainer asked me to change my style of writing to a certain way, uh, which which would be good for my uh, writing marks as well. So that's what I did, and uh, and that kind of helped me a lot, I must say. No, I'm really happy because we managed to get it done in the very first attempt without wasting a lot of attempts, without wasting a lot of time. But I know you were doing it for a couple of months. You were not very yeah. regular. But you had work scheduled, but still, um, how did you manage to maintain the consistency? I think all that I made sure is because I knew that my weakest point, part of this exam was writing because it wasn't quite up to the mark as it should be. So I started uh, concentrating more on that particular thing and I made sure that whether or not I attend, attend classes, I made sure that I, I write at least four essays in a week. Wow. And that was a continuous process for two months or more than that, as you said. And I think that kind of really helps to enhance my writing skills. Okay. And you think the feedback which you, you know, you were writing the essays on, the feedback on those essays were very regular yeah, yeah. and helpful? That was, that was extremely helpful because uh, whenever I was writing essays, I used to make sure that I attend maybe the next morning or the next evening and at least get it checked uh, by him, even though I, I won't be staying for long enough, like yes. for five minutes or 10 minutes, peep into the class and get his get his feedback that's 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 what is very important i'm really happy now let's move to the listening one as well because we got 8.5 almost perfect score what was your secret when it comes to listening i think the listening ones that we did in the class were quite tough so what i'm trying to say is it was above the standard so the benchmark was quite high uh, because of which i didn't really face much problem during the real exam right so yeah. Any final valuable tip, Ayanta, you want to put it out there for the students? I really want you to focus on your writing and speaking because these are two main modes where students struggle a lot. Any final tip from your side, you know, which you want to share to the students out there? So if they are struggling or if they're going to attempt this exam soon, they can take care of those things. I think uh, with the speaking, I will say like, uh, just, uh, just concentrate on what you can do and uh, try to be fluent as everyone says. Like, don't worry much about the grammar or anything like that. Yes, you might get a deduction for it. But uh, I think what my trainer used to say is like fluency is the main thing. So concentrate yes. on that and the rest of the yes. things will fall in place. Yes. But, and with the writing thing, what I did is I had a couple of pieces, like not a couple of pieces, like about 20 or 25 pieces probably in the last two months written by me. And it was checked by Amit, um, uh, my trainer. So I made a notes and collected all the good phrases, vocabs, or the idioms, or how to conclude, or introductions from yeah. past right. and made a document about it, about yeah. two pages long. And all I, that I did is like I just had a look at it for quite a, some quite some time in the last uh, couple of days. So yeah, that's right. pretty much. I it. think that was the final, you know, um, I would say strike on the nail when we, you know, got all the essays done, checked and reviewed and, yeah, you know, yeah. improved. Um, great, I'm uh, really, again, very excited and happy because we are finally, you know, getting a desired score within, you know, time frame without wasting a lot of attempts. And um, uh, again, best of luck to you, Ayanda, for your future and for your future migration purposes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Ayanda.